2010, HEWA were already experiencing growing pains and with the help of some market research, we could foresee that we'd be needing new premises in the foreseeable future. There were no places available for rent suitable to our needs and finally, after two years of intermittent searching, we found six land rail court Beckenham. We selected this site due to its access to main arterial roads, power line clearances and the potential for future growth. Being one of the first to purchase in the development, we were able to specifically select this position which has the best access for semi-trailers to reverse into the factory, a $1.5 million investment. When it came to the building design, we first had to establish a height in order to be able to fit today's new generation of extra large PHEs straight into our door. We then had to ensure that the structure could support a 32 tonne gantry crane to lift these XL PHEs. To our knowledge, we are the only company in the Southern Hemisphere that has this capability. The 32 tonne crane was a $200,000 investment, which will now mean no more wasted standing time for our clients transport companies while we wait for a crane to arrive. Total building investment, 2.3 million. All the above simply creates more efficiencies for us to be able to start processing your work sooner. Here you'll see our custom engineered and built tanks, a $250,000 investment. These tanks will relieve a severe bottleneck that occurs in our current process. We're increasing our chemical capacity from 5,000 to 17,000 litres per tank. We can now simultaneously soak in the chemicals four times the quantity of M30 plates and twice the quantity of T50 plates. These tanks have a double jacket and are insulated to help maintain their temperature. We will be increasing the temps of our chemicals from 60 to 85 degrees due to the fact that for every 10 degrees the cleaning action doubles. You'll note that the tanks are built in zones which enable us to tailor its operation to the amount of work coming through. When we need to, we can reduce the amount of energy being pumped into the tank by 75%. At its peak, our tanks will draw 80 kilowatts, which for a business our size is substantial. To offset this, we have invested in $170,000 worth of solar panels. 400 panels in total that will produce up to 100 kilowatts of energy. The theory is that we only want our tanks to be heated during daylight hours. In total, with numerous added ancillaries we've not mentioned here due to time restraints, the new Heat Exchanges WA facility has equated to more than a $5 million plus investment. All designed to service your plate heat exchanges more efficiently than we presently do. Please come and visit us at any time to inspect. You'll be more than welcome.